located in Indonesia, west of the island of Papua New Guinea, Raja Ampat or the Four Kings consists of four big and over 1,500 small islands. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. My friend uh, talked for me, looking for you. Uh, the owner for homestay. Yende Babo? Yende Babo, right. Yende Babo homestay will be our place to stay for the next days. In Raja Ampat, there are three options for accommodation live aboards, dive resorts, or homestays. With the first two being utterly expensive, the homestays are the only place for normal mortals to stay. Even so, don't expect backpacker prizes. The only way to get to those remote islands is with a ferry from Sorong to the island's only town, Waisai. There we will be picked up by motorboat by our host. First we need to change some money, because the $100 per person we had to pay as an entry ticket to the whole area left us without cash. Go horsey, follow that princess! Here there is the smelliest market we've ever seen. And that's the place our host is buying food for us. I never thought the road to paradise can be so noisy. The homestays are eco-resorts built using traditional materials owned by the local villagers with basic rooms and affordable prices. Homestays are all on the beach and most of them have their own coral reef. So, first thing next day we jump in for some great snorkeling. Finding Nemo! The Raja Ampat Islands are remote and relatively undisturbed by humans, and the marine life here is the highest recorded on Earth. It's the richest coral reef ecosystem in the world. If you don't like it chilly, you've got a problem. If you don't like meat, you've got no problem at all. Because there is always the good old rice. Okay. Malam. The most picturesque spot in Raja Ampat is Pianiemo. It's a long boat ride until there, but the scenery is absolutely breathtaking. Be careful, gas is very expensive, so it won't be cheap to get around by motorboat. But it's the only way. eat, drink or lick a coconut and it tastes like coconut! Yeah, yeah, Bupa. 
The main reason for coming here is diving. Staying at home stays guarantees you cheaper dives, but the gear can be old and, well, sometimes you have to have guts to dive with what you get. Hmm, not our case, of course. Unfortunately, our main underwater camera got broken during day one, so our underwater footage is taken with a cheap action cam. Sorry about that, folks. The high marine diversity in Raja Ampat is strongly influenced by its position between the Indian and the Pacific Oceans. It's the paradise for divers, but due to the currents and sometimes limited visibility, not for beginners. Between dives you can try to find small islands just for yourself. Bye-bye until next year!